All right, well, hello, YouTubers. All right, I'm going to show you about these. This is a window cover for a car. You buy these at Dollar Tree for a dollar, okay? And uh, these are really handy. These are even better for insulating the one with little bubbles in them that are real thick. They're even better. Um, but if you say you work with DoorDash and they give you that space blanket, this is much like the inside of a DoorDash bag. See, there's a DoorDash bag. Not very much like that. So, I don't like these because they let the heat out because this is open but doesn't seal so I really don't care for these bags but um, uh, you can get a bag that, that's like this a cheap bag that zips up and you can take this and put it inside and uh, put the foil towards the food and we'll keep it very very hot if you haven't got your DoorDash bag yet You can even get one of these for a dollar at Dollar Tree or Walmart And also line it with this and use it temporarily and it will really keep the food hot Okay, that's two dollars for a bag if you don't have a hot bag you need an extra hot bag um, This is a nice zipper padded bag this one here and you can, and it has a flat bottom too. And you can take this and take it and put it like this and stuff it inside this bag to make it an ultra hot bag. And then put the food in there. Okay. And then cover it up. And then zip it up. Now the space blanket or hot blanket like DoorDash gives you, it looks to me like a tablecloth cover that's metallic plastic that you can get for a couple dollars at Walmart or Dollar Tree in the party section. Um, so this is a lot better because um, these are so-called insulated. And when you're done with it, take it and put it in the shower, hold it up and rinse off both sides of hot water, hang it to dry, you're set. But you can use it. This is a good bag. These go like three hours, these bags. And it's super insulated. These are custom. And you can take this liner and put it in this bag. Stick your food in. Cover it up and zip it up, okay? And that's ultra hot, okay? And you can do it in this bag, okay? Which I have put one of these types with the little bubbles in it in the bottom. They're about $10 and up. Put that in the bottom in this ultra hot bag and that is really super good for keeping eating. But say you have, you know, uh, one pizza or two pizzas, turn this to the metallic side, stick your pizza in there, cover this up, and you can do it for each pizza or just cover up both pizzas. This, this bag will take three to four pizzas. And take that and zip that devil up. And guess what? You have a really hot bag. And these bags go a lot of hours too. Now, you won't have to use this in something like this. This is a super duty insulated bag, which I put my drinks in, or cold products in, like salsas or desserts. And I use ice packs all around it too. And then you zip this up. See how thick that is? That's ultra thick. Okay, and I zip that up, and that's super cool. And that is made by Ozark Trail, but you're talking forty dollars and up for something like that. Um, I have electric units that heat and cool, 
they are problematic because they do go out. Sometimes the cold stops, sometimes the hot stops, sometimes the whole thing stops. Um, and then you've got to worry about power. You need to have a battery for your car that is so strong because, like me, I run my Garmin GPS and the cigarette lighter and my phone charger because you use a lot of phone battery on these, these driving apps. So I really don't need to have any more power used up while I'm sitting. So I really don't care for my electric units. But this is good, but you won't have to do that with this at all because these are so insulated, it's amazing. But that's a cool tip. One dollar. Three dollars at Walmart. I'm three dollars at Walmart, but a dollar, a dollar tree. Get a bunch, stick one in each bag, and you be living. Alright? So I hope that helps you. Throw me a cool thumbs up. And please subscribe. Have a great day. Love to you. And remember, as always, make a new friend and do something kind for a stranger.